Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we are giving you a tour of Spanish Town Road. Now the government plans to spend $11 billion to rehabilitate this road. Now this is one of the busiest roads in Jamaica because it takes you from Mandela Highway to the intersection of Hagley Park Road where you can go to Halfway Tree via Hagley Park Road and it takes you from Mandela to downtown Kingston, which is one of the busiest places in Jamaica. Now you have a lot of communities, a lot of business places off this road. I mean, some of the most popular areas in Jamaica like Tivoli Gardens, West Kingston, Trenchtown, Arnett Gardens, Olympic Gardens, Sea View Gardens, you name it, uh, you access those communities off this road. It's a very busy road. And Mandela Highway is the busiest road in Jamaica. And this road takes you to Mandela Highway. Haglip, um, Halfway Tree is the busiest place in Jamaica. And this road takes you from Mandela to Halfway Tree. So you know it's a very busy road. It takes you to Halfway Tree but at the intersection with Haglip Park Road. And this road takes you off it intersects with Mandela Highway which is the busiest road in Jamaica and it takes you to the busiest intersection in Jamaica which is the intersection of Spanish Town Road and Hagley Park Road so this road definitely needs to be rehabilitated it's six lanes three on either side all the way to downtown Kingston or I think somewhere along the way it merges to four lanes so very important road and the latest is the government put together the proposal and it worked out to 11 billion and they're actually going to the eu the eu for funding not china hub engineering company not the china exim bank which in itself is something to think about because china hub engineering company has been doing a lot of these projects now i'm not saying china harbor won't do the work if the EU funds it but when the loans come through the China Exim Bank or the financing comes through the China Exim Bank they ask that China Harbor Engineering Company does the work and they do an excellent job they are among the 10 largest construction companies in the world the work that they have done in Jamaica is amazing let's put it that way they are so far ahead of the local contractors that Jamaica is definitely benefiting from China Harbor. Now, I don't know why they're going to the EU. Some people have left some comments in the section. Thank you guys for that. We'll do a follow-up video. But if government said they're looking to the EU to finance three major projects in Jamaica, this road at 11 billion, the expansion of Grange Lane in Portmore, which I think is 2 billion, and the building of the bypasses in Hopewell and Lucy at 17 billion. So it's very interesting, but I guess it doesn't, at the end of the day, it doesn't matter who finances the project as long as it's done. So that's the latest on this road. Now they recently did some work with, with the laying of pipes. Some bigger pipes were laid along this road and the roads leading off it there you can see water commission on the left doing some more work and because of all the communities that are served by this road and the communities are growing so they need more water so the pipes that were there could not bring in enough water to supply those areas so they put in bigger pipes so that water problem should be solved so however in digging up the road the road has gotten a bit worse because to lay these pipes in jamaica you have to dig up the roads so now that that work is finished they are looking to rehabilitate the entire stretch of spanish town road now I don't think it's going to be that difficult a job because the road is here, the boundaries are here, 
the water pipes have already been laid so it's basically just rehabilitating the road so I guess it just comes down now to the funding Alright guys, we'll keep you guys updated on, on this project and the latest. We'll keep you up to date on the latest news to do with this project. Alright guys, thanks for taking the tour with us today. Remember to like, share and subscribe. So enjoy the rest of the video. We are going to be turning on to... Oh, what's the name of this road again? It's Washington Gardens area. I'll tell you the name. Where? Not Oregon Farm. Hang on. Weymouth Drive. I'm going to turn on to Weymouth Drive and head back to Washington Boulevard. Alright guys, enjoy the drive through Washington Gardens. Alright guys, have a good day.